on the off season and uh and yet are you trying to add any pitches to your repertoire uh right now i'm just trying to really work on um look at my fastball getting better location of that working not only low in the zone but being able to use that elevated fastball um to draw swings from hitters trying to work more um depth of pitches as well with i'm trying to or i'm going to be working on my slider more this fall or not my slider my uh, change up more this fall gonna be working on curveball command in um in positive or even counts and in uh, positive counts for me and then um that's why I might be working with a slider, uh, but I'm not sure about that yet. With the whole starting rotation gone this year, you know, you obviously probably have to be excited to possibly take on a bigger role and more responsibility this year. Yeah, you know, I'm definitely going to be uh, trying to start this year, but uh, in the end, it's up to the coaches. You know, whoever they see fit is going to be in the rotation. So. When you go back and look at the, the little bit of a slide you had last year, what do you attribute that to, you know, to say, hey, now I know what happened, I can fix it. Yeah, you know, I definitely um, learned a lot from last year. You know, I'm always trying to keep learning and keep applying um, the new stuff I find out or uh, that I learn, new information I learned from summer ball and stuff like that uh, to my game. Um, but yeah, no, I'm going to definitely take and apply that to this year and, you know, try and work through it, work through the harder times of the season. Can you tell us about your summer league season, who did you play for, and, and how did it go? Who are some of the players you played with? Yeah. Sort of um, so I played for Cape Cod for a week on the Hyannis Harbor Hawks. Played with some great guys out there. Um, and then I, I was, or, yeah, uh, great guys out there. And then I played for USA um, with Seth, teammates. Um, it was a fun time, fun experience. I learned so much. I got coached by an all-star staff. It was Troy Buckley, it was um, John Savage was our head coach. Troy Buckley was assistant pitching, was pitching coach. Seth Moore was assistant coach. Um, we're just a overall great coach and staff. And I feel like that definitely is going to be the, you know, um, component that uh, promotes my success. What's, know, what's it like season. getting out with different guys, hearing different voices, learning different things? It's just, it's all about like different perspectives. I mean, you can always learn from everyone because everyone has a different perspective on the game. And just learn it from you know not only our coaches here at Clemson but uh, coaches you know from I guess across the country. It's just it's cool to just see the different perspectives on baseball. Last year you sat beside behind Pat and some of those other guys who were leaders on the pitching staff. This year you're looking to make a transition into a leadership role. What's that like? It's good. It's it's something that I've had been able to experience. I guess with the past couple of years we've been able to or I've been able to see leaders and how they've acted and how. You know results that have come from that and the leadership um, role they played but you know I'm really just hoping to make an impact on our on our freshmen on our underclassmen and make the positive impact that you know how to be a Clemson Tiger how to play baseball here at Clemson so you seem to, you, you seem to really enjoy, you seem to really embrace the uh, the closer role last season no. if, if you don't end up a, a star weekend or midweek starter is that something you really look forward to? I'm, again, you know, the coach is going to decide, but I'm willing to fall into any role, the closer role. I'm obviously, a, last year was fun to play, to be a closer, and this year I'm going to try to my best to be a starter, and if that doesn't pan out, then I'm sure I could possibly end up back there. What's it going to take for you to get into that starting role this year? What are you going to have to do in the fall and in the spring to get there? Just experience. I think, you know, Coach C, he's getting us, getting all the pitchers ready and getting all the guys who are going to possibly start ready to start with the throne program we've been doing up until this point so far with individual work. And it's just going to be experience in the end because the only experience I've, I've had in college so far is uh, my freshman year. So um, it'll just be kind of a reaching back to the good old days, I guess, of freshman year and uh, you know pulling it out for this year. So Thank you, Riley.